this and invite guests of the dais, esteemed chairman or members of TMA, Malian Council, beloved members of TMA, dear student members, see a big caution. Give it a break up. Not the very answer, let me express my sincere gratitude to all those who have presented themselves for this function in time. My first bounden duty is to welcome this honest gathering to the function. On behalf of the President EMA, and on my own behalf, let me offer a very cordial and respectful welcome to President the President Sly, who has kindly accepted the invitation to come over here. Cinema the interesting talk, contributing to the future scenario. And what guess the new function all the members of the union, especially those who died recently, the members of the staffers, and all of the assembly who is on the way. It's my privilege and pleasure to introduce the guest of honor to this August audience, who he is well known all over India and abroad as a joint of computation, privacy, and brain mathematics, his customary. Professor Matthew Sangar is now here, the heading news these two departments in the University of Kerala and has been playing the roles of a teacher, researcher, professional guy, and science communicator of more than three decades in India and the world. College of Engineering in Madrid, IIT Bombay, University of Cambridge, and University of Kerala have been his algorithms. Machine learning, image processing, and biosequence analysis are the areas in which he has counted his expertise and experience. It's humbling to know that we have to under extension that the whole genome sequence of Arogya Pacha and Sangamushpam were sequenced on the foundation. Thirty research scholars with PhD under the guidance of Professor Kathy Sengar. As the director of CNIT during 2001 to 2004, he successfully executed many signature projects of the University Government of Canada. These are many major responsibilities. We shouldered on the University of Canada. Speaking about the definitions conferred on him for his academic excellence, he received the first national teacher award in the National Science Academy in 2014. This was followed by many awards, including Wycombe Maulavi Award for Social Service. He has other books on different topics like Python programming, deep learning. Campus politics and longer experience He is the author of a novel by name Tari, which means thinking sensation. And this is a historic science fiction, if you want to read, by Henry. It's very interesting to learn that Orchestra Warner is an ardent now, a practitioner of Carnatic vision. He designs programs connecting people or incidents. The very recent one last week, at Trivandrum Orchestra Foundation. Was based on Lazarus, which I miss. Ladies and gentlemen, our guest of honor, Professor Prachu Sanger, is a multifaceted personality, connects with the students, professionals, and common people through his magic of AI, music, and literary talents. He has kindly agreed to tell us to the world of artificial intelligence, touching upon positive and negative aspects, highlighting its astounding experiments with severe limitations. These works are a great pleasure. To present for you, that was a two second slide to this audience. Thank you. Dr. Ratichand, I just want to add on to what Sarah said. He has a YouTube channel, this is called by I think it's called Everybody All Over the World. There's an amazing, brilliant mind. And over to you, ladies and gentlemen, here is Dr. Ratichand. Very good evening to one and all. There are many faces that I recognize, including the mistress of ceremony. Is that what you call it? <laughs> but I uh, don't go into the risk of trying to recall names and then going wrong. But I know many of you, I love you. That's all I would like to say. I will first, you know, this is a management association investment in platform. 
So I suppose that they wouldn't be unhappy that the department might depart. So my department is a very green department of the University of Kerala. Oh. 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 So these are not from the department. These are just to make you happy. I think that uh, happiness comes through very small things. And one of the ways in which you become happy is uh, seeing nature, touching nature, thinking of nature, being in nature. So inside the hall, I'm just trying to bring in some nature. What a wonderful feel it is to eat from a banana leaf. Many people say that we must use banana leaf because it's eco-friendly. It's not just eco-friendly, it's happiness friendly. You touch a copper blade, there's no human feeling in it. But here is a life thing on which you put your food and then eat. This is a thought from beautiful thought I like to explain the time here from Kanon. This is our a very rare shop of Kathmas meters which I stored when I when I ascended the made the money there and from the top of that I photographed it some years ago. Okay. So friends, I'm very happy to give you a very, very general talk about artificial intelligence and how it is evolving. Title it. Is it a new partner in progress? Or is it an intruder to the ultimate republic? So I'll tell you later what the ultimate republic is. Uh, this is what I'm going to talk about. Rather than giving you a technical introduction to AI, what I will do is I will sketch here eight future scenarios of AI. What will happen with, when AI develops like what it is doing now? Uh, I think that there is no separate future for each country. As far as technology is concerned, it's going to be the same everywhere. And therefore, what I'm speaking is not something specific to Kerala. I will try to make it Kerala specific as much as I can. So uh, I think I have marketed my department yet. Yeah, this is my department. Don't you think it's great? <laughs> uh, there's this window opening to the sky, and there is this green creeper coming down and touching the ground. And I wish all the young people who walk into the department, they are promote, they are motivated to have their thoughts in the sky and from the ground. That is the idea of the architect. So we have a sculpture of a Mana Devada in the department. I just thought I would. I may try to make her speak for you, but I can get it done by email. So on another occasion, I will you. know, you take this photograph, give it to a website and give a help sentence and this this will start speaking. The video will be produced of the speaking. That is one thing that you can try to open it today. So this is also the department. We have a best class. I think you have come and see that class. We have a coloring classroom where we the, the students can come and see that it's very cool because of the coolness of the soil that gets. It's a small department. I think you would, you would see that uh, we normally criticize our university for not coming in world ranking. But do you know that our university is definitely the University of Kerala is world number one in something? Can you look at the picture and say what? Women. I once went to a university in Sweden and the vice president or somebody there, a senior lady, told me that welcome to one of the rare universities of Europe where the gender ratio is the best in Europe. And she said 30% of our students are women. I congratulated her and then said I come from a university where 10% of our students are men. But still, the university union's vice chairman position is a reserved for men. Actually, it should have been the other way around. That's still not working. The university gives 60% of its PhDs to be men. Uh, but the syndicate has 24 members in which one, one is there. So these are some facts about our university. Okay, so we get into the discussion. We know that we have recently had a lot of cases of students forging certificates. 
So my feeling is that because of technology, privilege investigation is so precise and powerful. I was just telling Dr. Rani that a thief broke into my house. We were all asleep last, last year. Stole all the digital devices. I think the guy was unnecessarily wasting time because the police got hold of him and got all the digital devices. The only thing he could do is at least sell it, weighing it for its weight if he can sell it, but he can never use it as a phone because it will all, always be punished. Uh, so, unless somebody is very politically committed and how you commit crime, you are bound to be. That's not enough. Now we want to go one step forward. We want to catch people before they do it right. So, that's called predictive police. Imagine that the boy who is going to forge his certificate gets up in the morning, comes out of the house, and he finds the police there. You're going to make four certificates in the shop, the arrest him. Before it is done, the arrest him. Now, it, it may not surprise you. There are few you know, no retired policemen. I hope there are no retired soldiers and policemen here. <laughs> if there are, then kindly pardon me. Mazakar Pata Tamuna. The so police are, when they retire, they sit idle in their veranda and they watch people walking here and there. Which means that, you know, you have a capability of identifying whether somebody has a criminal. Now, AI can It has already started being used. But then, this raises a large number of issues. I will address it all together. Uh, for example, in many private uh, shopping malls, they put a camera in the entrance, and when people walk, suddenly the security officer gets a message saying that two guys walking, they don't seem to be coming here for shopping. There are two sub terminal. This can be read just like a very, very uh, you know, seasoned police officer trying to look into the face and then reading this. This is possible. It's called predictive policy. Uh, it's the tip of an iceberg of what it could do in mind reading. I will be coming to that in a few minutes. So, after every slide, there will be a nature picture to cool your mind. This, I think, most of you know the driverless cars. They are actually not just AI, they are AI plus all other. Modern mechanisms like, for example, cameras and all that. But uh, what is this going to do? We have this, we have this controversy about uh, KRE. So transportation, the idea of transportation might take a very great paradigm shift if we introduce the driverless cars. Now you see in Kerala, you see eight line roads coming in. So my suggestion is that that one four line is enough. That one line that can be opened for ordinary traffic. The other four lines can be made as a tramway for driverless cars. No pedestrian can enter. Only driverless cars can enter. And then you know what happens. I am going from here to Kochi. Normally when I go, there is one person doesn't want to go to Kochi, but has to be my car. That is my driver. So you remove that. You don't. Any longer need that person to sit there unnecessarily. You know, the potential of a very young person being wasted just sitting at the, uh, the wheel of the table. So, this is going to change and that marginally increase the fuel efficiency. I think Dr. Andy would vouch for that. He's a mechanical engineer. Uh, no horns anymore. Because in that tramway, vehicles don't need to press on. Of course, there's no need to press on because there's no driver. And horns required when the other engine does not know that you are coming. But in case of driverless cars, every vehicle knows where every other vehicle in its vicinity are. Something like 100 meters, this vehicle knows what other vehicles are there around and where their positions are, what velocity they are going, where should they go in. All of this is exchanged between vehicles at this. Like and therefore, there is no need for you to copy not. There is no need for ambulance screen anymore. I think most people they have taken the bus part of that. I think they don't know, in fact, because all screening and the noise that 
Ambulance means, you know, pressure signal, which is received by the community now, and then no ambulance is coming, they would actually be way from here. And the person sitting inside a car being given a So this is a term between the, the car, the, the computers of cars. Uh, so no traffic police is required because the cars are run by algorithms. And algorithms don't break law. Human beings break law. Algorithms don't. So police need not wait and watch and do things of that sort. You don't need an AI camera also because every computer has it. Why do you need an AI camera from the government? And no traffic lights because the whole traffic is done according to the rules set and given to all the cars. So there is there's no need for there's no need for cars to wait at a junction. And there is no traffic jam. Unless, of course, Pakistan creates a virus and sends it to the car management network, and then the cars purposefully go and create a jam. There would be no more parking space crunch. Every car can be found anywhere. You want to park, park a car in the middle of the road. Problem is that the other cars will come and the drivers will come and uh, rubbish. But the algorithms don't do that. They know that one car is parked in the middle of the road. So they will go around. That is what we should also do. We have to create a lot of points. So that also happens. You can park a car area. Doesn't really matter. No more, nearly no more. So can you start the number of accidents we come to one by one? And then have to be vehicle insurance industry. Do you really need vehicles to be? Insurance. This is one of the scenarios as far as the driverless cars are concerned. You may know that when Waymo was produced and tested in the US, you go to YouTube, you can see a lot of driverless cars, driverless vans going, very big ones going. Uh, there are two things to note. One, when it was produced, the first market they looked for was India. So they came to India, they met the Minister for Surface Transport. And he was an earlier trade union leader. He said, no, we don't want this. No, we did think of it. But the, the behavior of technology is that you cannot stop it. Even politicians cannot stop it. It's very difficult in a democratic country for a technology to be stopped. So what happened, like the Uber, when Uber came, you know, the, a lot of trade unions in Kerala, they tried to prevent it. For about six months, there was a lot of trouble with Uber businesses. But now what has happened is everybody is on Uber. On the other issues are on Uber. Because when technology offers convenience, then people have a choice and they will always go for convenience. Convenience is the biggest killer, I would say. We, we can talk about it itself. Mm -hmm. So this is the photograph of the whole department taken last week. I think you can see me there. So thank you. This is, uh, you must have seen this. Her renovation is if not trying to do this. Called artificial creativity or generative AI. So, there are many websites which offer generative AI, especially with reference to uh, pictures, images. So, this one I, I did with a website called Vianato. So, I asked it, can you draw me a picture of Jesus Christ shaking hands with? Buddha, Lord Buddha. So it produced this picture. It takes about two minutes to produce this picture. I think it's very realistic. The, the, the mind of the computer is very clever. You can see here a lady or a Christian creature here. And did you notice that the building where they are meeting is like a Chinese architecture? So it's taken both backgrounds are taken care of, you know. And then, you know, the, the glowing radiance of the faces of all these. I think it is like a produced by an artist. And they shake hands very properly. And you see Buddha doesn't have prayer. Yeah. Jesus has one. And it's all meticulously prepared. So what is what does this mean? Now we no longer need to have an artist. You say what you want and it produces a picture. Now this technology is not up to the mark. It has grown more. But before you are critical, I'd like to tell you, look at AI as a four year old child. Whatever it is doing is miraculous for a four year old child. 
stage declines for your every year it is going to be. so at four years if you can do this this demand so now i asked it about the coconut tree you know kerala is land of coconut trees but we have i was just talking to dr gandhi you were saying about not taking the uh, center tank of coconuts that you see on the road side uh, if you would like me to speak about it i can speak for a long time don't eat banana because they all have tamil nadu don't take uh, coconut uh, tender coconut on the road side they are all produced in the worst way possible in fact it is also a great cheating if a foreigner comes you buy a tender coconut from the wholesale and give it to you you are actually underselling kerala that is not the tender when somebody comes to cut a coconut in your house you ask him which are all of course bengali you ask them to pluck one tender one and you pluck it you know it actually burns that small eye of it it burns and it comes out and it is very much like sprite you know it's actually uh, looks very much like a auto retrieval of the coconut and in that place you are giving a very uh, in english and in kannada and in kannada it is strong like sprite far removed from the very beautiful tender coconut that we really want the sign to enjoy that is what is happening coconut tree land of coconut trees kerala thinga kerala nadana pare jayinte thai nu marai do you know what is the very minor things of a coconut tree is fiber chair chagi kerala nadaka you know that nala pura lot of people who live with by feeding kerala but do you know where the fiber comes the fiber comes from tamil nadu The problem is that Kerala we have no farming of coconuts. They go on the they go on the. Chadala Kerala that Chennai region or the part of Kerala that we take. So Tamil Nadu is only one section that is not taking the farm. So easy to deal with the soil. So do you know that sometimes our minister, industries minister, has to go to Tamil Nadu and say, please give us the soil. That is what happens. Other which plant are there? So Tena comes from Tamil Nadu, Kaya comes from Tamil Nadu, Banana comes. All that form of oil country. Who will get? Who will get? You will see lot of growing, carrying lot of Banana. Do you have any objection that I divert like this? You watch. They are all in Tamil Nadu district. So I was just telling him that I go take the main road. I take a secret route from. Um, Power of Bonham to Kariyatta. Right, that's the main road only for about uh, 50 meters. So I come through a very secret route. In that secret route, in the morning, I find a lot of people holding the banana. I'm not sure about holding the children. Now that I'm coming, I'm very much like I'm not going to go there. I'm not going to come and go there. So I buy that banana. And after many years of buying that, I learned how to differentiate the banana from Tamil Nadu and banana. Tamil Nadu. I have learned that Tamil Nadu is not like Chennai. Chennai 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 is not like Chennai. ായിട്ടാണ് <laughs> ഒരുക്കാത്തിരിക്കും 
കേരളത്തിലെ ഏറ്റവും വലിയ ബ്രാൻഡ് നെയിം ആരും ആരെയും പഠിപ്പിച്ചു കൊടുക്കുക അങ്ങനെ ബ്രാൻഡ് നെയിം ആർക്കും വേണം എടുത്ത് ഉപയോഗിക്കാം മിസ്യൂസ് ചെയ്യാം അത് പറഞ്ഞാൽ ആ ആ ബ്രാൻഡ് തിരുവനന്തപുരത്ത് ഏത് മുക്കാട ചെന്നിട്ട് പഴക്കം വരച്ചാൽ നല്ല പഴം പിന്നെ സ്വന്തം നാളെ പഴം അപ്പൊ അത് കേട്ടാ നമ്മളെ <laughs> Because if you want to cut the correct tree and take it away, you have to give 7,000 rupees. If you want to cut the tree, you can cut the tree and cut the tree. If you want to cut the tree, you can cut the tree. If you want to cut the tree, you can cut the tree. 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 ഫ്യൂച്ചർ <laughs> you can convert the coconut trees to produce coconuts with taste of pineapple taste of peraka taste of jamaka taste of mango so i think that is quite possible now with better models now other than that i can we want pineapple and they need to be free this that is not what i expected i said no no show a coconut tree in pineapple and mango coming together then it show this but then they but they are not told in the right ഡിസൈൻ <laughs> i think this you all of you know i can if you have to use anybody want uh, see a demonstration i will do that uh, but let me first share some few thoughts on chat gpt is a kind of domain of generative ai it produces text uh, this is a i asked him to write a poem over gandhi he writes a poem you can ask it to me write in malayalam also uh its english is as good as tashi tarur's english but its malayalam is as bad as tashi tarur's uh the news are really writing for you very great meaning so you can actually what can ask about this called a prompt you say in more detail it will do it so for example you ask it to write a poem about kerala to write a poem with describing its very beautiful and long so if you say write a poem about kerala i want you to highlight that it is not uh asuram on the created kerala but uh, it is when the zone was on my kerala for the data so it is due to contribution people with contribution from science contribution knowledge in the parana that i'm going to say matthew that is wrong to end of the time anko അതിനോട് ചോദ്യം ചോദിച്ചാൽ എന്ത് ഇതുവരുമായിട്ട് മറുപടി പറയുന്ന ഉദാഹരണം ഗാന്ധിജി ഗൂഗിളിനെ കണ്ടിരുന്നെങ്കിൽ എന്ത് ചെയ്യുമായിരുന്നു എനിക്ക് ഇത് കുറച്ച് സംസാരിച്ചാൽ കൊള്ളാമെന്ന് ഗാന്ധിജി ഒരുപാട് പുസ്തകങ്ങളുണ്ടെങ്കിലോ in fact i am inclusive like agree with what he has said but in practice in the practice i have also asked gandhi ji why did you travel in the train you see the whole you see he traveled in the train 
ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಅದೇ ಥರ ನಾನು ನೋಡುವ ಹಿಂಗೆ ಶಾಸ್ತ್ರ ಈಗ ಅಲ್ಪ ಸೊ ದಿಸ್ ಈಸ್ ಈ ವುಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಲೈಫ್ ಗೂಗಲ್ಸ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ದಾಸಿ ಈಸ್ ಅ ಮ್ಯಾನ್ ಆಫ್ ಟ್ರೂತ್ ಫಾರ್ ಹಿಮ್ ದ ಗಾಡ್ ವಾಸ್ ಟ್ರೂತ್ and google makes it easy to find facts and share information with others and thereby helping people to move closer to truth and therefore mahatma gandhi would have liked it and other you know google and the value of yes tell me like you google choice up there and the google nature the mama so much so much i used to i was saying he is a quiz student he was there So, uh, I used to say, Google is a Mahaguru. You ask anything, it will tell you. It's very knowledgeable. It will tell you. But now I, I corrected myself. No, no, Google is not Mahaguru. Google is just an encyclopedia. Encyclopedia. Why? What is the difference between Google and a human teacher? 12 o'clock in the night, you ask Google. I want to put a bomb in Kavri Adhanshi. Tell me how to make a bomb. Who will you believe? If a student calls me at 12 o'clock in the night and says, Sir, tell me how to make a bomb. A bomb carrier. I do that. I will possibly call the father or mother. If I have the energy and I am the inclination, I would drive him straight to his house or her house. And then tell the parents something is wrong. Please take care. And it's a difference between Google and Google. Google is not a guru at all. Because Google has no value system. There's no value system like it. Chattimity has. If you ask Chattimity how to commit suicide, it will not answer. Not only that, Kerala Kilana is not a situation where he doesn't bomb. Who would you ask? Try it. A lot of people ask me if I am. Uh, you know, I work in Kerala University for a very long time. Many people during interviews ask me, you study abroad. What is the difference? So I tell them, if I were a person in the university where I study, I would not have a lot of news, but I would have survived as a English teacher. I would have managed, I would have completed my term. But if the British University teacher is posted at Kerala University, where they are? Where they are? The moment you enter the gate, two students look at the left and ask, Are you, do you agree with the left? Yeah. And after some time, somebody else asks, Do you agree with the right? That's why I went there. I thought that I was going to tell you, I didn't like it, I didn't like it. I didn't like it, 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 I didn't like it. So that you can, your left, this trouble is over, you can do something. You know, this is something. So, uh, if you ask Chad GPT, Do you think that Kerala is being governed well? You won't ask. It will tell you whether a state is being governed well is not a very objective thing. Because people can put a lot of criteria to decide whether a state is being run well. Okay, then it will say, okay, so I cannot say an opinion, but I can give you some facts, like Kerala's GDP is increasing, uh, Kerala's uh, you know, economic situation is it, uh, debt is it increasing. It gives all these figures and that's it. You can make your choice. That's a very clever answer. So that means it has a value system. What it should say. And if you ask Google to show you some pictures that you, you can, you normally cannot show others. Google will do that. But if you ask that to write a nasty joke, it will say, sorry, I cannot do that. And you ask him to write jokes about communities. Again, it will say, no, no, that's not fair. That should not be done. So, Jarapak is going to be done. I have a number of jokes. But, but, a number of jokes are going to be done. I have a number of jokes. I have a number of jokes. I have a number of jokes. So, Gandhi, Chattimiti understands Gandhi to an extent that it can answer a hypothetical question about Gandhi. This is the status of artificial intelligence. And who is saying this? A four-year-old child is saying. Chargement is equivalent to a four-year-old baby. And it still answers. So can I imagine what will happen five years down the line? If you're very curious to know, as managers, I yesterday watched the interview. You are Harari, 
and then the final one is the function of p is where we so many interested. So the person who quiz them said, please tell us what will happen in this message. So he says, this is not my words, his words. You have some money with you. You want to make more money. So you normally you go and uh, put this money in some business. Sometimes you succeed, sometimes you fail. And then a lot of things have fallen in place before this money can work to any business to earn it. So he says, you don't need to trust anybody. You can give it to a AA program. What's on the AA program do? It will listen to you. You say, I want to make money. And this is the field I'm interested in. Let's say some network business or something. Then what that program will do is, the program will tell you, okay, you don't think you deposit this money in success is bad. And thereafter, it will some communication or post in social media as well as some groups that it knows. And say that, here is an investment that is ready and um, does somebody have an idea that this investment can be used? So somebody puts up an answer saying that, oh, I would like to uh, consider, you to consider this idea. What does the AI do? The AI will take your photograph, you know, make a video, and then send that video to that person. You are speaking to that person. Then that person says, okay, I want a phone call. So the AI makes a phone call to your so tell that person, tell me, tell me, let me listen, let me hear what you have to say. So he says that. Okay? And then finally, you agree on it and you make an agreement. And then it consults and you have say, please make a draft. Uh, uh, or you finalize the draft, you can you finalize that. Okay? So this communication, until these decisions, business decisions, are going to be taken by an AI and to an extent that the person and the other does not even know that this is taken by an AI. This is what this person said on the interview, which is very, very, very possible. And uh, the time frame he said five years. So this is our best classroom. You see the, all of them are very happy. And we, leave, we talk about this throughout the world. And so it is post -trust. Truth is still there. But we don't, do not know what to trust, what is true. Trust is gone. So yesterday, my friend sent me a, a big, my friend up in London. He said, you now know forward a lot of interesting videos. He said, I'm very unsure to forward. See, for example, I show you this. There is a building in Saudi Arabia where they talk. And to reduce the air pollution expense, it has an amber. So you switch on that uh, in the evening or when the sun is ready, then the amber lights. So he says, I do not know whether this is true. So you have all wonderful things coming to you, but you have no idea whether this is true or not. So if you start verifying that you have time only for that. So we live in a world where nothing can be used. What way is to make it before you forward three more, three, four days? Then if it is very you know, send another video saying this is wrong, this is copying from this, that like this, etc. So wait for that. Nothing can be trusted in the world of AI. That we are getting to see in Kerala a case was reported where somebody's video is produced. It's called deep fake. Deep fake. You can look at the internet, not website which offer you video photograph, and then it produces a video. So just let us not all think this negatively. But it must be true, I tell you. Take your grandfather's grandfather or great grandfather. And then give a you know type text below that. Give it to this website. It'll produce a video of your great grandfather's video. It's a bit scary sometimes. Today I received a WhatsApp uh, invitation for the science. Science test, I think, being organized in Joanna. So it's a promo video. And you know who speaks in the video? Who types of things? Who types of says, Oh, I'm very glad to know that there is an event being held in Kerala and that it is going to focus on these, these things. It produces an very waste. Very waste. So our video can be produced by others. It can be misused. Politicians will find a very big issue. 
what they do is actually they use it also. It, it, second step that they also use. So uh, it is this picture you see here is another another graph. You can produce pictures and videos of people who never exist. This lady never exists. So there is a website called this person does not exist.com. You go there and just read, press space bar, it will show people. Beautiful photographs, science, social photographs of people who are not of no, we never exist. Things never existed. So it is this is called an NRAGB AI. You can produce text, you can produce video, you can produce images, you can produce audio, music, all are produced by artists. So this is the age of generating AI. Now I touch upon and told to talk about both positives and negatives. So in the morning, at six o'clock, if you go to museum junction, you see some very strange things. For example, one person drives a BMW car. I imagine that it's the best car. I don't know. I'm not a great fan of cars. The car is more than 822 years old. I do not know what BMW is, but I. Imagine it is a very great car, very big, costly car. So somebody drives it, comes, parks it in front of the museum, he gets down and walks without any age. He just goes around that car. Where is he going? No way. Why is he not using his car? Because that car or the whole industrialization or the gifted as was that with our body in his car. I heard there's some convenience is a killer. So earlier you wanted to make dosha, you have to first of all think. Now I come back and I give them a good Then you have to after it has been soaked well, I'm like, I will have the kitchen kayuchi. Think of which will have found the value. Three years now. And you have to get three good lines. And for two hours, maybe two and a half hours, and then the dosha is made. Today, uh, there are many ways of doing it. What is, of course, you can put the uh, soaked uh, things into the grinder. Then you just press them. But times have changed. Now you don't have to do that. You just take your mobile phone and push like this, and then the dosha. Try the dosha. It's like this dosha itself. <laughs> So you want to take a taxi? Yes, taxi. It's not magic. It's not magic. You want to see somebody, you're below. Then you can see. So everything is coming to you with just a trust of your This is what happens. In the second period, 50 years ago, the people in the hall, big hall in the second period, they were long, Mats with frames with two holes and what's outside, and he pulls it so that there is wind inside. So that boy gets some exercise. But today, the officer comes into the hall, then presents the fan. Oh, you, you know how many fans are there in Kerala? Sorry, in India, in an electrical engineer. You know, the only thing people see of an electrical engineer is the fan. There are 50 crores of fans. In, in, in India, you have 143 crores of people, 50 crores of fans. 50 crores of fans are taking away how many horsepower of human comes. So, what happens is we have so much of mechanization, our body doesn't get enough opportunity to exercise. So, we have to artificially exercise. Adi Shankara walked from Kaladi to Kaspi. Imagine. And then took a right turn. And walk Calcutta, Mandra. And then took a reverse turn, walk to Gujarat, then to Tamil Nadu, then to Toronto, then to Samaya. Can you walk from here to Madam? Would it differ? No. What happened? Human body is made to exercise. You have to have the right to movements. If you don't have that, you won't be happy, you won't be there. Human body is made to be exercised. 
Convenience, when it comes, you can never think of the earlier form of usage. About Artwell and the Eden, the Jews of Marekia, Panya, Alec, we have a very car and gender, So, this is what has happened to humanity in general, I would say. The, in future, what is going to happen is that the AI is going to take away exercise of your brain. If you are going to do it, you will exercise. And the one of the brain exercise. If you are going to do it, you will leave the tribe, the email tribe. There are going to be even the white and the ground and the food. That is the idea. We will be able to do it. 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 Today, there are very uh, flowery emails coming to us. Given the fact that you have not, uh, you have always supported us in times of our uh, challenges, uh, I am expecting that you would appreciate that I have a personal emergency in home. In this context, I would like to tell you that I will leave no stones unturned to a, uh, make up for the studies that I am going to miss, and it will be a great. Pleasure and privilege if you thanks uh, leave for one day. And I can't remember it. Right, isn't it? Would a chance to give? Pranayikin or Kanaki, what are they? They want the unique rare treatment for a very much. Okay, I'm going to go to the long time. 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 Write a long letter for my villain. Please use a Greek theme for the letter. Of a Greek, they were able to do the name of the Niki Mono Green, you know, the particular name. Because of Ryan, the key where I am, you talk about my beloved life's brain, you write an email in which there is a lot of reference to rain. I got an art of Umbra Puig and a father and a little bit. In the body of us, those are all in the theory. And those who care about the world, those who are quite a matter of each other. So, this is going to take away the brain's ability to create, which I would like to tell you the brain is actually like a muscle. We have a lot of brain in the neuron of billions of trillions of neuron cells that are connected to the synaptic connections. We have a lot of chamber and education. Physically, that is the meaning of it. So, you are going to leave it without exercise. How do you say it? How do you say it? ഡോക്ടർ <laughs> Suppose I ask a person, sir, you have to put a stop so that I can, I can end. I, I do not know what time is. <laughs> so you ask a person to hold that very heavy briefings. It is given to that uh, person and said, on no condition you should brief case on the ground. You on the ground, you have to you know, withdraw. So that person holds it very heavy. What do you think he will do or she will do that? Thank you, boss. No, he cannot put it down. That's all. Other freedom is there. Okay, he's standing. That is as if he's standing. Don't you think he might change to the right hand? So, with the brain of this is true. You see, there are a lot of people who now say that we have to have scientific temperament, do everything that science, science is the god or the, the, the other gods. The point is that if you are scientific in everything that you do, it will be like holding a boss in your left hand for a long time. Because if science logic is working in your brain in the left side, then it is. All other things, all other nonsenses are here. What are those nonsenses? 
അങ്ങനെ സ്വപ്ന കവിത കഥ അപ്പൊ എറകാശത്തെ പെട്ടി പിടിച്ചോണ്ടിരുന്ന കുറച്ച് കഴിയുമ്പോഴത്തേക്കും ഈ കൈ വെച്ച് തോന്നി അതിനാണ് ഇറക്കി പടം കാണിക്കുന്നത് എല്ലാ കാണിക്കുന്നു ചെടി കാണിക്കുന്നു ആൾക്കാരെ കാണിക്കുന്നു സയൻസ് മാത്രം ഞാൻ ഐ കോൺട്രിബ്യൂട്ടിന്റെ ബാക്കി കാര്യങ്ങൾ പ്രണയിക്കുന്നവര് സയൻസ് അപ്ലൈ നിന്നെ പോലെ നീയാണ് പ്രപഞ്ചത്തിൽ ഏറ്റവും വലിയ സ്വന്തം ഞാൻ നമ്മൾ ഇപ്പോഴൊന്നും കണ്ടതല്ല നമ്മൾ ഇവ യുവാന്തരാണെങ്കിൽ മുഴുവൻ പെണ്ണുങ്ങളുണ്ടെന്ന് കാരണം അതില് നിങ്ങൾക്ക് പ്രണയിക്കാവുന്ന ആ മുന്നൂറ് കോടി ആൾക്കാരെ നിങ്ങൾക്ക് സൗകര്യം അളന്ന് മെഷർമെന്റ് എടുത്ത് അത് എക്സൽഷീറ്റിൽ ഉണ്ടെങ്കിൽ ആയിരിക്കണം ഞാനാണ് സൗത്ത് ഈ ഏറ്റവും കൂടുതൽ എന്ന് പറഞ്ഞാൽ പ്രണയം കൂടുതൽ this is a when i was uh, working in feed it i made a small cut all with coconut part so you see that everything in current and kala kala the manam kala dai it is sandoshana ni kriya andre mind reading ne kuch samay thoda bhi baat mind reading is uh, used for predictive policy kaamgat mark kala kaamgat mark kala kaamgat mark thara valiya prashna aagum കേരളത്തിലെ രാഷ്ട്രീയം ിട്ടിയാണെങ്കിൽ <laughs> <laughs> ഇന്നത്തെ കാലത്ത് ഈ സ്ത്രീകളെ കുറിച്ചിട്ടുള്ള പരാമർശം നടത്തുമ്പോൾ പൊളിറ്റിക്കലി കറക്റ്റാണെന്ന് എനിക്ക് അറിഞ്ഞില്ല ഞാൻ പെണ്ണിനാണെന്ന് വിചാരിച്ചിട്ട് അത് സംബന്ധിച്ചു അറിഞ്ഞില്ല നമുക്കറിയാം ഇന്ന് ക്രൈം അഗൻസ്റ്റ് വിമൻ പെട്ടെന്ന് കേസ് ആകുകയും ഒരുപാട് നമ്പേഴ്സ് റിപ്പോർട്ട് ചെയ്യപ്പെടുകയും ചെയ്യും പക്ഷെ കുറച്ച് കഴിഞ്ഞ് ഞാൻ കാണുന്നു കാരണം എന്ന് വെച്ച് കഴിഞ്ഞാൽ സൈഡിലൂടെ നടന്നു പോയ ഒരാള് എന്നെ എന്നെ കണ്ടിട്ട് വികാരം തോന്നി എന്നുള്ളത് ഈ മൊബൈലിൽ കണ്ടുപിടിച്ച് കാരണം മോഹനൊക്കെ കണ്ടുപിടിച്ചിട്ട് റിപ്പോർട്ട് ചെയ്താലെന്തായി ജീവിക്കും നമുക്ക് ആൾക്കാരോട് ദേഷ്യം തോന്നും ആൾക്കാരോട് അസൂയം തോന്നും ആൾക്കാരോട് വികാരം തോന്നും എന്നെല്ലാം പറയുന്നത് അതായത് ഇതുവരെ ഉന്തിക്കിടന്ന ആർക്കും അറിയാനും കാത്ത ചില ലോകങ്ങളിലും ഇവിടെ പണ്ട് പറയുന്ന അന്തരാത്മ സൂര്യൻ ഉണ്ടാകും മനസ്സില്ലാത്ത ഒരു സൂര്യൻ കുറിച്ചിട്ട് ആൾക്കാരുണ്ടെങ്കിലും ഒക്കെ I think it will be a real camel in the world if that happens. Because if you think about it, 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 if you think about
their actions can be inspected. In a cultural society, people's actions can be inspected if it is in a public space. Or somebody complains. Nobody knows. I felt that India that is there in your mind. So if somebody is going to read that song in North Korea, South Korea, North Korea, China, in the Lashan, the China is the same. Now, uh, I have heard many people say that uh, the Indian people are not going to be like China. It's just looking at your left. which makes no sense to you. I will tell you I have a small analogy. Except your body, but you can only come to this conclusion based on what you can see on you directly. Whereas, if you go to a modern practitioner of modern medicine, how do you understand it? Then the doctor gets to see an image that the naked eye has. And from that, the doctor is coming to a conclusion. Yeah, right. The convolution network is not the same as the regular scanner. So it's not possible for us to understand how the mind of the computer works. So I call it the intensity of the computer. That's what I call it. That's what I call it. You know, the great linguist Noam Chomsky has gone on to criticize the tagging and he's saying that it's not working well. Do you respect to him? I feel that he has understood what the new technology. They are there for the car and for again. You see that like so. So you can read emotion. And let him also get the Sunday show again. So why he can read the TV again? Control also need to know. Yeah, predict the end. Can we do this again? I mean, Kerala challenge will be clear. Kerala challenge. So another future scenario: automated decision making. You must note that in North India, one can only do this. So, I think we can do it. So, I think we can do it. Government does make me also go to generate the data. Indian blocks, Niamh, and the white sector, would be a little bit of a negative data on the half. And perhaps whether it would be better or worse than the human law, we do not know. Language barrier is no longer there. I think you all know. We all practice. We can get language translated from any language together. The other way, the language of your mind. That's it. Malayala Marshall and Malayala Malayala language has its intoxicating beauty. Chalera Mahi Mahi Hai, Viva the Sumat Oka. So, you know, I'm going to say that you can catch me as well. I'm going to say that you can catch me as well. I'm going to say that you can catch me as well. So it's of course whether whenever you see this, you know, but four-year-old child is making this translation. Four-year-old child. So you want more more translations? You can see. Kadil tel pada, chavile tel na hamen translate. I what I've done is I've translated and re-translated to see what makes sense. I'll change the shape of magical language. Then badly ni hindi mo pa dito niyong chip. Then na makar na yara na problem na mas yara makar ka drama. So with Moya, it's very, it's very challenging to translate. That is all that I want to show you. Actually, you say one beautiful definition of poetry is that poetry is what that cannot be translated. Another Kerala challenge. Famous Sunday simple dialogue. Talking about this. 
ഒന്ന് വികടനവാദികളും പ്രതിക്രിയാവാദികളും പുലർന്നിയ അങ്ങനെ ചെയ്തായിരുന്നു So that translated, let's see how beautifully it's translated. I mean, I'm going to talk a little bit. First, on those separatists and reactionary, we have to say, see, it's strange. It must be assumed that the other way between them was empty. Our other people are under the axis of your mind. And then, she might have to go, oh, same thing, you get few words of it, right? I didn't get it. Hello. So, you can actually go to uh, translate and try to solve. <laughs> Not something great. We can do that. Translate is a very really external translation in this. Pointing things not expected to translate. But other matter of fact things, management is a no good young person to translate it. We said, Malayala is a no good translate it. That's what we said. In the end of the day, we said, 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 ഈ കണക്ക് ചെയ്തോണ്ടിരിക്കുമ്പോ കണക്ക് എക്സസൈസ് കൊടുത്തിട്ട് അവർ നോക്കുമ്പോ ഒരുപാട് പേരുടെ തെറ്റിൽ പച്ചലായിട്ട് തെറ്റിയിൽ ചോക്കലേറ്റ് ആണെങ്കിൽ ചൂടിൽ Because at the end of three years after you study something happens, right? So if you can make it happen directly, you don't have to spend three hours, three years. You can do it in two hours. No matter what happens, it's very small. We need a new correlation to cinema. Rats for one and a half hours or two hours. But it takes three years to decide how that film should be. No matter what, she program runs for three years. But the university needs only two days to decide what to do. Now I'm going to press it all. Now I will close here. I will now uh, be available for discussions and questions. Either you are aware of some such a thing. It's quite one of the very. It's my nightmare if the university says entrance exam put hundred percent. We have a choice of state. Our lady don't know it all. Our lady don't know. They are looking for people to guide their society. Oh no, no. You must tell them. Sadly, we didn't do it. Give me hundred multiple choice questions on Constitution of India. നൂറ് ചോദ്യം ഞാൻ അനുസരിക്കുന്ന ഒരു നമ്മൾ നേരെ കോപ്പി പേസ്റ്റ് ചെയ്യുന്നു പ്രിന്റ് ചെയ്യുന്നു വേണമെങ്കിൽ എഡിറ്റ് ചെയ്യുന്നതിൽ ചോയ്സ് അവർക്ക് മാറ്റി വരുന്നത് ചെയ്യാം വിച്ച് ഇസ് നോട്ട് ദയർ ഗൂഗിൾ വിച്ച് ഇസ് നോട്ട് ദയർ എനിവേ ഇങ്ങനെ ചോദ്യമാണ് അത് ഡയറക്റ്റ് പരീക്ഷ ചോദിക്കാൻ വേണ്ട സിലബസ് ഇതാ ചില സ്ഥലങ്ങളിലൊക്കെ ഇട്ട ഉത്തരം വാല്യൂ ചെയ്യുന്ന വലിയ ഡേഞ്ചറസ് മാർക്ക് കുറച്ചിട്ടാൽ നേതാവിന് മാർക്ക് കുറച്ചു കൊടുത്തു ചാൻസ് ഇന്ത്യയിലേക്കാണ് ഓൾസോ മാർ ഉത്തരം ടൈപ്പ് ചെയ്ത് കിട്ടിയ ചാറ്റിഫൈഡ് കൊടുത്തിട്ട് ഇപ്പോൾ അഞ്ചിൽ എത്ര മാർക്ക് കൊടുക്കും എന്തുകൊണ്ട് ചോദിച്ചാൽ അത് എഴുതി ഞാൻ നാല് മാർക്ക് കൊടുക്കും കാരണം എഞ്ചിന്റെ പോയിന്റ് സാധ്യത ഇതിന്റെ പോയിന്റ് കൂടെ പറയാൻ കഴിയും എന്ന് എഴുതി തരാൻ സാധിക്കും സോഫ്റ്റ്വെയർ നമ്മൾ പിന്നെ ഓക്കെ ഐ വിൽ സ്റ്റോപ്പ് ഹിയർ ഐ വുഡ് ലൈക്ക് ടു മേക്ക് വൺ സ്റ്റേറ്റ്മെന്റ് അബൌട്ട് എ ഐ സോ ഐ ഡോ സെറ്റ് ഇറ്റ് ലൈക്കിംഗ് ഐ ജസ്റ്റ് ബിറ്റ് ഇഫ് യു വോണ്ട് ടു അൺഫാസ് എനി തിങ് ലൈക്ക് ഇറ്റ് ഓൾസോ യു കാൻ So my leading light in my career, my teaching career, is this great thinker, education, called Jerome Hoda. What, does, what did he say? Among many profound things he said, he said, anything can be taught to him. Anything can be taught to him. Of course, there are conditions applying, but this is what uh, he initially said. Now, I would like to close my lecture by saying, my own quote, anything can be learned by God. That is Asia. Anything can be done. So have no doubt. Right. Uh, if the tradition is that you must have sufficient examples given the computer, for so that we learn. If you have examples, then we will learn anything. And it is also surprising that behind, this is one only one equation I show, behind the whole bottom performance of AI, there is actually a very schoolish not really schoolish equation y is equal to w x all of this charging with the regular car this work in very simple manifestations and the issue so i stop here i will be happy to hear your comment take your questions so, so sir can you just raise your hand we will do a few votes that is for the next question the money like this what is the safety now that ai cannot uh, be used uh, 
to sort of counterfeit currency. Yeah, it is possible. Everything is possible. So we are uh, the government is when when we put uh, like all this sort of audience that you stop so in US face recognition, but it's not a public institution should be bad. Yeah, we do not know about the experience and we have been enjoying more than right? me. But it's a okay. very anti-social thing to do that. Look at people and yeah, look at people and things last look at people like more dangerous than political movements, all of these issues. And we have still be a very great means of forgery and by human. So that is quite uh very important. Yes, sir. Yeah, uh, you have talked about the uh, crisis. So, when you explain it, What we need to say about the AI to say about the AI? No, you are not going to be stopped. It's just to be in the same. It's still a moment. It's still a moment. It's still a moment. It's still a Say, I have a refreshing question. Do you think AI will have some time receiving or reach enlightenment? No. Can touch the power? Okay. Yeah. So, now, I'm asking you, how come scientists are going to They are realizing that such questions should come. So, they post their passage for intelligence. So they want them to be in this. And they said, we don't go into each less of the question. But if the computer can fool people in thinking that, Right, that's the issue. this. So they don't go into the chat, but really, really I, I can hold the, uh, I can, I can offer to hold my line. That's true. So, like when people ask, crazy, are you, are you, then he said, the only difference between a man, man, and me is that I am not bad. The only difference between a non man and me is that I am not bad. And so many difference. So similarly, the only difference of thought and enlightened AI is that enlightened AI is not enlightened. That is the only difference. But you could you could mislead people to enlightenment with two AI. Excuse me. Yeah, sir. Right now, the AI, uh, when you ask a question, it is only up to 2021. Yeah. And it's a language based prompt. Yeah. It does not have some, you know, other kind of you know, prompt monster. Yeah. So, how do you go beyond? You said it's a four year old child, but it's a really language based child. Then, actually, what is happening is there, the other tools take other tools. For example, there are image based uh, AI, where you give an image, it will fuck. It will give you a description of it. If you give a description, it will produce an image. So now what remains is as these things start maturing, you will combine them. And that's called multi-modal AI. So it will come soon. It will come very soon. Yeah. Professor, uh, brilliant uh, presentation. Thank you. Professor, a lot of thank you. We are done a lot. So we can do now. Thank you. Uh, I understand um, uh, what and then AI is going to be able to develop it. And second is, uh, you're talking about brain, uh, the average books thing. If you don't lose this on me, thoroughly, we was able to read the other person's mind. What do you think? Okay, on the first question, uh, it was a good part of the week. So I just admit that I'm not a well read person or well and worked in that area. No. But to my understanding, we still so so. It is mostly related to the hardware of the computer and not the software. And therefore, it is not a replacement for AI. No one heard it is a replacement for AI. Maybe it will make a better platform for AI to work. And the current computers can almost be nice to 
Then so it's fast. So we should not answer my answer as well. So uh, it's a second. On the second one was about uh, Elon Musk. I think Elon Musk is crazy, very clever, and whatever he plays, he uh, gets done. So let us wait to see what he, he does. Yeah, that was. Yeah. Um, since we talked about AI as an advancement, as something that will push the computer race forward, right? But how is it any different from the automobile or the computer? So just the scale and the pace of transformation are in fact much higher. But at the end of the day, if uh, we don't get with it, don't learn to use it and utilize it, those who don't need it, those who don't. Well, this is the picture with the whole uh, technology and even the whole civilization. You know, when it was merely knowledge, there were certain people who held knowledge who did not have knowledge. Uh, so, with computers, we talk about digital divide. Now, we have to possibly talk about AI divide, which is a, a kind of a digital divide itself. So, this has to be addressed. And possibly, what we can do is we can use chat GPT how to address this. Question can never be wrong. So this all No, no, very important question as I am person asking it, I still think they will oh, sorry. It is going to affect will steal a lot of jobs. But uh, we look back at history and see what computers do. When computers came, they were in Jamandam near the uh, secretariat. The general post office there, there was an anti computerization committee. I have written about it. Uh, they opposed the computer from the introduction of computer. But if you look back now, computers have produced more jobs than just taken away jobs. Yeah. There are many jobs taken away. For example, look at just photo studios, they no longer there. A lot of people who were there to write boats, they are not there. You have plus 20, which is available. But there are so many DGP shops, there are so many. Uh, flash printing shops, there are so many designer shops. So, what will happen is, I asked ChatGPT also, he said, We won't lose jobs, jobs will be transformed, which also is a problem. A person who has been um, conducting a studio, photography studio for 30 years, all of a sudden, they don't know, you know, do all this. Now we have to buy a computer and be doing things otherwise. So, at that age, that person finds it very difficult. I remember a person, he just knows stuff. Because he couldn't, he felt he couldn't learn computers. So it will, it will transform some jobs. But after some time, it will stimulate and produce more jobs. And uh, economic disparity, we must also remember. Today we need an office assistant to help us write letters. But that also will, the cost of that will also come down. You ask that if you write that you get a letter. So your investment also comes down, and newer jobs are going to be generated. So, uh, it's a, don't take my answer as my own answer, that to be answer. So, but it is a very serious answer. Any other questions? Yeah. Thank you. Sir. Yeah. Sir, so, uh, Very dense place in the dark. You know, if I answer it, will be very political. You have to go back to nature. You have to go back to simple happiness in life, uh, which is calling for a Gandhian village kind of life, which people may not agree. So, Final answer is that we don't know what to do. So it's, it's more immediate problem for you because I don't have any real for you.
you have too many years for your boss. I think you will find the answer. They want to also clean it up. They want to enter. It is after you were one day or other. Three days, then you were. Because there is no thing. Then I got my photograph 40 years later, 40 years back. Cancer. But it's a point. It's cancer. And 40 years back, whatever it is, I'll give it to her. Can I make a button to that kind of situation? Something human body. Also, in the work of the infant telomere, that is where it is terribly known as the aging problem in the forest. So, scientists are trying to uh, see what that, how that coding works and try to mutate it and affect it. Oh. So, I'm not very sure whether we would be able to do it on you or me. But maybe when these young people become very old, mm -hmm. come where you can reverse your uh, staging. I do not know whether it is of any use. <laughs> because uh, you will still want to live dog. And another thing is, you don't realize when I'm a man, if I do the joy, I'm going to do the joy. I'm going to do the joy. So we are already you know, four times we are having longer. So it's a question of shaking the car and young people. And the vulture okay, is very nice to think about how it is misleading to think that it is not nice to live long. So uh scientists crazy things. Some of looking at the ethical issues, but they are just pursuing it as a matter of knowing how to do it, pursuing it from outside. But uh, the best thing is to not be researching on such thing. Come back to basic pleasures of the human society and ensure how these pleasures are uh, more evenly divided uh, instrumented in society, which actually does not need a lot of uh, technology, but we need Buddhas and Jesus Christ. That is what we need. They will make us be very happy about what we like to be. Technology typically it makes you more and more unhappy about something else. I used to wait for the best. My friend, this Mirandi Suresh Mirandi is here. We used to wait for the best in Chavani objection, and we had to wait for 45 minutes, 50 minutes to be found. Very frustrating. So now, how are we? This key it is not coming. Wait, standing up and I'm saying this more than anyone. After many minutes, it's a big issue for me. It's not part of it. I think that uh, when the people are encouraged to say it is such a beautiful thing to sit in Javadim objection, wait for 40 minutes, hope for a best to come. When the best comes, it disappoints me, but you still don't lose hope. That is how another side of life will flower. Uh, this, and that's why I said it's a political answer. You know, I'm suggesting that you lead a spiritual life rather than a retirement life. And uh, what goes on in the so-called mind 
that we can have a global. Imagine it's going to be, we don't want to put this going on in there. You know, suppose somebody knows to Adam's very well. They come to you and say, I love you. And you are able to, you are unable to understand that they are right. So what happens if you, uh, you uh, let's say, reaction is low. So you feel both. You feel blessed. You feel happy. But actually that person has no love for you. But still, it affects also on you. So similarly, chat GPT does something to you. It can make you feel as if it is emotional. And for you, that is what matters. You understand this fine point that I'm saying? So chat GPT has no use. It has no emotion. And people who are young and know this. In other country, when I think about cinema, theater, and I was young until I was in 12th standard, very really secondary, and I was in 12th standard. ഇൻസ്റ്റിറ്റ്യൂട്ടിൽ <laughs> 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 So, similarly, a technologist might infect like, chat GPT and immediately say there's no emotion because you know what happens? We get shattered. But an innocent person sitting in front of chat will be astonished with the kind of things that get. Okay. And they will feel like this is really possible. You did nothing but Just keep, take keywords from your talk and then talk back something. But sir, I don't know how to do it. Human also is what I want to do. I don't know how to do it. Down to any extent. I refer to innocent down, but I have a lot of angels of the top. Does that answer me in some way? One last question. One last question. The gym. So, United Nations has already come up with a draft law, which I think in our video also is a report. And uh, we also have to make local laws regarding it. It's very essential to do this. Got a question. ഇതിനെക്കുറിച്ച് <laughs> 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 It is unethical. It can do unethical things. So he has launched a ethical AI for the, the, the projects he has launched. Something that when... Yeah, there are very good things. They should be done in the national channel. AI software, which has values and which will work according to those values. Chat GPT, Google World, Nokia, most of all, I believe. And they have all of these, I have to tell you, 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 But it's within a point where AI of black and white is within the name. Uh, I, I feel that you know, he's a very extraordinary person that I'm able to fully understand what he is talking about. But I don't understand what he is talking about. That was a brilliant session. Please put your hands together. Thank you.
you were a rare okay la la so can you take a seat i have yeah. what uh, we were talking about the very little ah sir sir when i am a problem and uh, i enjoy speaking to you i read that you enjoy listening to me that is what really matters so much so i added that from the front of yourself and i to few months what to say because people in kerala never accept anything so seriously unless there is a bit of humor people have the jump and they seem to react a few more you see and also i enjoy talking to people with such a humor because i feel that they want to talk really means is to make you more happy not just to make you more knowledgeful and like, well, those are all uh, less than thing most important thing is to be happy success means happiness if you are if you are happy then you are successful you are speaking of the fact that by other measures Uh, you are not successful. Like your marks or your stats, you know, things like that. So, so I'm very happy to see your green faces, especially very many young people. And uh, not so young people also have very green faces. <laughs> There's no reason for you to change that. Thank you so much, Jane. Can you talk? Can you talk? Can you talk? Can you talk? Chairman Lecture Program GMA and Mr. C. Rajendra Kumar, President GMA, to let me come back onto the stage. We are uh, extremely grateful for the time that you spent with us, the kind of investment that you've given, and just to share with you, uh, sir, the YouTube channel for Guru Jiya, and also if you are in, please do go. There's a lot. His connected nature, the holistic way he looks at everything, and intimate, biomimetic, even really good stuff. You know, so. Please, if you are a selfish kind of talking, put your own stuff on there. Put the chat on for each other. Meet the other dog and ask more questions. So um, now I will request uh, our president, Mr. C. Padma Kumar, to give us a small minute to have to open up one question from all of us. Then, by the word of that, I invite Mr. Lord Kushi, Joint Secretary of DMA, for a registered hat. I'm standing before you with a great uh, pressure. I won't take much time, but I I have to say one thing. I think uh, for every every month we come back similar lecture series meetings every month. But I think this is the one which I have seen for the last few years with this with uh, the uh, success with the Abhinavas. The Lord, I am very much grateful for all the people assembled here, especially the students. They came from the colleges in Lucknow and made this program a success. So this is a huge responsibility. This uh, today. Uh, we know that prior professor actually started with this is for any introduction as the person who introduced himself but we all know that i have a very good long association with him and i was with the kerala state council for science technology and environment he was a active participant or an expert which we lay upon for many scientific issues But still, or during those days itself, he got traveled uh, and fifty interview years back itself. He came with a very novel thing, and he was, if you say like that, he was traveling before us, and he was enlightening us, and he was giving us a pointing the direction to where the society is going. So, sir, on behalf of Toronto uh, Management Association, I extend a uh, Long uh, this uh, what are you saying? You know, we are having many or in among the audience, many. I I told you that many lot many students are there, especially from BCS Math and many other MBA uh, colleges in the city. We have we got many students. We are having the principal of BCS Math, uh, man, Doctor Shubhra Das with us. And we extend a warm thanks to all of the students and all the families, GMA members, and most of the kids. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.
Thank you, sir. And thanks, TMA. And also, please talk over the TMA page. You will find today's lecture is available there. So you can go back to it multiple times. Predictive policing, driver the science, artificial intelligence, chat GPT. Thank you, sir. Great. In those exercises, what? Making language translation. Directly reading and manipulating the brain. Where? Yeah. 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 Yeah.